The archive we're looking at is the Rowley Collection. Dr Rowley was born in Skipton and along with his friend collected hundreds of photographs of old Skipton. His request was to leave his collection, his notes, to Skipton Library so everybody in the town could benefit from them. Where's that, Gil? Um, I think it's like next to like the shop. It's like kind of next to Greg's. There's lots of people standing outside their shops looking really proud of their, of their shops. If you look down now, there's, there's a window where that writing is. All the furniture outside instead of in the shop. The thing that drew me into this picture was the writing on the wall and how you can't really read it. So it's kind of like a mystery for what it is. I chose it because I thought of like how unhygienic it was, like all the um, meat rolled up on the walls. I chose the photo because I'm familiar with the location of it. In the 1920s, I think, there was a great flood and the canal flooded. And that's why the water level looks so high. Sometimes it's told by shops. So if there's a shop on the high street, that I knew was only there for a certain period of time. And they look like the Peaky Blinders, they've all, all got the flat caps. Mm. Um, this guy up at the front is wearing his big long uh, white fur coat, he looks like Al Capone or someone. The wagon sort of represents like sort of a western style and it's like, it really shows how fast Kitchen has come. The picture was taken like just across the road, like pointing towards the library. I like the caveat in the photo because it shows how much vehicles have changed. Just leave it, leave it here like that. And that's probably why there's so many people standing around having a look. They're probably assessing the, the damage. I just think it looked very cool. It's an estate agent. It was taken on the high street. People could get ill from it, like animal poison, and maybe like die as well. I find it interesting to see how like the buildings have changed over the past couple hundred years.